There are so many stories I could tell you of people who have had to go through cancer treatments or, you know, recovering from injuries or who have said to me, I couldn't have done it without my practice. And one student who had to go through, years ago, a round of chemo and radiation, and uh, she was then in remission for a period of time. She began to practice mindfulness. She got very uh, engaged with our community and practiced a lot. And then she had a recurrence of her cancer and had to go through these kind of draconian treatments again. And she said, the difference in my life going through this now from eight years ago when I didn't have the practice is huge. She stayed cheerful. She actually was so happy and grateful and appreciative of the times when she didn't feel sick and was able to do things. And she unfortunately didn't heal, but she inspired our whole community by talking honestly about what it was like to practice in the midst of that ordeal and what it was like to face her death. Mm. So that's a very big example, or kind of giant example, but I like it because it really shows that this works even under extremely painful, difficult circumstances. Yeah, yeah, it sure does, yeah. Yeah, so what I'm hearing with that is is really, and I've had this experience before, it's like if, if you kind of go into the pain, there's like there's almost more to it, you know? It's not like yeah. a constant exactly. thing, you know? It, sometimes it's really bad, sometimes it, it's, you know, it's, it, it's motion. It's not a thing. Yeah. And this is what we're learning in the deepest way through mindfulness of the body. We are not a thing. Right. We are a process. Right. Unfolding. Right. And we're also not that. Like right. we're not the pain. Exactly. Like we can see we're the pain, we can feel the pain, we can witness the pain. That. Right. And we learn how to enlarge the field of our awareness so that pain can become just a piece of what's happening. Just as you're saying. Right. And not overwhelm us with its totality. Mm. That's amazing. 